Question number 30, we are given that g of x is equal to x squared plus 3x. We are asked to find g of x plus 1 minus g of x. Already g of x is given. All we have to do is to substitute the value of x with x plus 1. So we have, uh, wherever we have x, we replace it with x plus 1. That is g of x plus 1 is equal to x plus 1 all squared from here. Then plus 3 multiplied by x plus 1. If you expand this, you have x squared plus 2x plus 1. Then if you distribute here, you have 3x. Okay, I have to add plus, plus 3x, then 3 times 1 is 3. This will give us x squared plus 2, and this will give us 5x, and 1, and this will give us 4. So this is g of x uh, plus 1. And finally, g of x plus 1, then minus g of x. It means we should take the whole of this and subtract what is given here. So this is equal to x squared plus 5x plus 4. Then you subtract x squared and you also subtract 3x. This will eliminate this. We have 5x minus 3x is 2x, 2x plus 4. And we have 2 in common, so you can bring 2 out. Inside we have x plus 2 by factorization. So our answer is 2 multiplied by x plus 2, which is option B.